10 million years ago, all of Africa was covered with dense rainforests. They were filled with all sorts of apes. Some of them moved along tree branches on all fours, others used only their hands. And there were some normally large and heavy ones who preferred to climb branches while holding their bodies upright. Over the period of a few million years, it slowly started to become colder and drier. The frequency of rains reduced. Forests started to dry out. All the apes that managed to survive had a choice to make. Option number one, the most enjoyable one, stay in the remaining forests. Option number two, the most unpromising one, go extinct. Option number three, the most exciting one. Some apes started to explore the vast plains that replaced forests. Those that used all floors to move around tree branches continued to do so, but on the ground. The ones that used their hands started to walk the earth, stepping on foot. It's not easy to find a shadow in the savanna, and the sun has no mercy. This was the main reason all the fur started to disappear off their bodies. As a result, younglings struggled to find something to grab on. So now their mothers had to carry them around on their hands. This caused some additional difficulties with food foraging and made them more vulnerable. So fathers had to start helping mothers by providing food and protection. The ones that did not care about each other gone extinct. Only the ones keeping their hands busy, staying united and attentive to each other were able to survive. So that's how apes became bipedal and kind to each other. As a result, ancient apes turned into Australopithecus but still not entirely human yet.